This is Lee Sterling of ParamountSports.com. And today I'm going to break down and predict the game. <laughs> National Championship implications, Big 12 Championship implications are on the line. It's a game between the Oklahoma Sooners and the Baylor Bears. Now, before I break down and predict this game, let me let you know what's cooking at Paramount Sports this weekend. Coming off a nice bounce back weekend last weekend in the football, it's called November. Three weeks from now through the end of the month, get football, and there's football every day now. We've got Maction games going on Tuesdays and Wednesdays, so you can get football, and that's normally it. But we're going to add hockey, where we're number one in the world. We're going to add basketball, NBA, which has been going on for almost a month, and college basketball, which started a couple days ago, and UFC. We've won five of the last seven UFC cards. All four sports, $297 for three weeks, ParamountSports.com, and if you're already a client of one sport, you can add the other three for $150. ParamountSports.com or 800-400-9741. Now, on to this game on Saturday where Oklahoma is laying five and a half to six at Baylor. So, oh, you made the quarterback change a few games ago to Caleb Williams. And it is obviously an upgrade over Spencer Rattler. But does this team really look like a 9-0 team to you? doesn't look like a 9-0 team to me. Uh, their defense, I don't think it's championship level. They're going to have to face a Baylor team that played arguably the worst game by far last week when they played TCU and lost. Their quarterback, Gary Bohannon, just had a bad game. He was off. Only had a 61.2 quarterback rating versus TCU. And then the defense played poorly. I think it was partially because TCU – was using a freshman quarterback. They had absolutely no film on him. Didn't know what to expect. And then also, Gary Patterson hanged around. He hangs around for a week after getting either fired, or whatever you want to call it, let go, um, a mutual agreement. So instead of either saying he's staying on to the end of the year or he's going to you know, leave immediately, he hangs around for a week and helps out the defense. So I think they were inspired by that. Think that Baylor's going to bounce back here. I like Dave Aranda's defenses at Baylor. In fact, they played OU last year on the road and only gave up 27 points and 269 total yards. So on the road, OU has been not nothing special. They've not been good at all. They're already 0-2 against the spread. Uh, they didn't cover, didn't even come close, almost lost the game outright at Kansas, and also didn't cover against Kansas State. Baylor at home. Where they're playing here, really good. 5-0 and straight up and against the spread this year. And I just think every Big Ten team wants their crack at Oklahoma and Texas before they leave. So I think this one's a little extra special here for Baylor. I think they're going to get the job done and win the game outright. I'm taking the 5.5-6. Look for Baylor to win this game 30-27. to Want to even sprinkle some money line here on Baylor and take the points and Predict maybe they win this game here outright. So go with Baylor. You want to hop on board and cash in big? Just one place. November, ParamountSports.com.